know? Is it like a, my crew. Is it like a, a love triangle? Like, I don't get it, you know? But yeah, we it's got, definitely a love we shot. got we got the mashing character versus the uh, I will not uh, approach you at all character, and that that is a good combo I think because Roy Roy doesn't want to play any other game than holding forward, and uh, Wario is good at stuffing those out. So yeah, it's I mean be rightfully so, but Wario can do just the same as you can see, opening up with a clean 65 right off the bat. Right now, it is Carflow's turn, kind of getting it off, but we already know Brad already got the tricks out on the deck. That's that famous bike he got. Yup, and the uh, the falling up air. I was going to say falling up air waft, but I was like, wait, we're like 30 seconds into the it, game. Listen, what it's a little too early right? for that. What is going on right now? I was like, ooh, I was about to pop off, but I was like, wait, 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 wait. He doesn't got that charge. <laughs> Yeah, you can see Carflow just trying to anti-air BDB right now, but Brad is kind of just holding it down right now. Bike to punish the jump, but the air dodge through is going to be landed, but hold up. Get your shoulders checked. He is holding center like somebody told him, you can't move from there. Like, you got to stay there. <laughs> like, if you get out of the center, you're, you're dead. Like, <laughs> there's immaculate stuff there from uh, BDB. That's what you got to do. This game is all about position. It's all about that awareness, and Brad... Knows that so, so well. So as you can see, just trying to come on in with the Nair, but Carful with the parry, almost taking the stock off the Dancing Blade. I always get nervous when a Roy hits a Dancing Blade at the edge because you never know what percent that you're dead at. Like, depending on the character, you could just be dead. And yeah, it's so like, scary. Will it kill? Yeah. Chat, will it kill? Will it kill? That, that killed? <laughs> answers in the chat. <laughs> well, yeah. <laughs> We gotta, we gotta stop it. Next time there's a side B, we gotta stop. We gotta have, uh, we gotta have somebody on the setup pause the game, and then we gotta play the game show. The will it kill is literally just a miss, or if it just hits, yeah. basically, much yeah. like that down to dash tech, the tried and true warrior combo. BD Bean is, is cl he clocked in for his nine to five, and he's making w big work of Working Carflow Nine to right five. Now. What a way to make Bro. a living. Yep, it is definitely, uh, it is a way. I wouldn't say what a way. <laughs> what a way, it do be a way. It's, it's a way, I wouldn't say what a way, but yeah. Um, yeah, it's been, it's been rough for Carflow. He hasn't been really been able to get very many of the, the sick Roy stuff. Going. I was waiting for that. I'm like, you're saying? Yeah. You, we already, we already know it's coming anytime soon. Up till, wah, we yep. don't miss those. Yep, we definitely, BDB doesn't miss those. I miss those, but. B a good if I player. miss that, I'm unplugging my controller. I'm walking away. <laughs> I'm like, all right, I'm I'm hitting the I'm hitting the hay. Yep. I'm sleeping for let's make big moves to bracket tomorrow. <laughs> I got I gotta I gotta get rid of my spectator pass and everything. I don't want to see I don't want to be seen around. Um, yeah, Carflow could not get anything going that entire game. Uh, BD Bean was holding center really well. Was playing the positions really well. Combo games was on tight, catching landings every single part of the game, all rounded. Amazing gameplay there, but you just think if Carflow can strike a little bit, just a teensy bit of fear into BD Bean, this could be an entirely different set. But BD Bean just looks too calm, too comfortable. You got to put him in his out of comfort zone. Yeah, it's really annoying to kind of just get in on Wario, right? Like you have to play really proactive. You yeah. know what Wario wants, right? You know what want to come and grab. Like there, just open up and bam, we're already quick damage. But Carflow with the red neck recognition to kind of just jump out of that, kind of ending it pretty early on. And this is what you got to do. Once you get through openings, you just got to carry. You got to yep. go to town. And look for those air dodges. You look for those arrows they might on throw. Even that bike. Don't let don't let BDB do that. Yeah. You know they want a bike. Yeah. And just because he used the bike right there, it's, it's going to take a little bit of time to recharge. I think he should be back now, but he had a... Ooh, what a chase. Oh, what a chase. BDB, this is some amazing stuff from him today. He just used the he just used the, the bike B reverse. Do, do you know about that? Oh, I know. You know? Oh, oh, I know. To get the amazing positioning on the nair, this guy's feeling it right now. Like sometimes it doesn't matter how good you're playing if somebody like BD Bean is just feeling himself right now, and he is definitely doing that right now. Yeah, you can see Carflow is really just struggling to get in and get in there. But all right, one solid grab. Might be what you need. One foot is in the door. You just got to walk yeah. all the way out. And right now, walk into the ledge off the dash attack. And there you go. Punish on the down air off that back air. This is more of a game, too, that I like to see. Both players amazing on their punish game. It isn't one-sided. And it can go either way right now. It is a lot different than game one. Mm -hmm. But you always got to remember, Wario with that combat mechanic. Got to say it once. This is the one time. The walk, <laughs> that's it. We're not talking about it ever again. Oh, my God. He almost had a chance to get it right there, but just misspaced his up tilt, and Carflow is going to punish that. 
amazing uh, recognition there from Carflow to just get an easy whiff punish uh, yep. off the misinput. And we're seeing that Roy and Fantasy State going real crazy right now. There's a call out on the what? bike with the backer wait, as wait, well. Wait. What happened there? <laughs> Bro, keeps, Bro keeps hitting the bike button and uh, Wario's looking around. He doesn't know what he's... He's looking for it. He's just getting mixed right now. He doesn't know where, where to look. He's like, where's my bike at? Bro, I want my bike. That what? was so smart. Did he? He knew Carflow was going to get um, aggressive there in the corner, and he said, I'm okay with this trade. Did and, he uh, walk or did he blow the bike? He walked it. I didn't even see he that. I heard it. the sound effect, but I yeah. didn't see that. <laughs> you got mixed. I got mixed. I would have not seen that. <laughs> but yeah, Carflow closes out the game. After a very creative use of waft there from BB Bean, uh, Carflow cl closes it out, and that was a lot better there from Carflow. But BD Bean had some good moments there too. Yeah. Uh, it'll be interesting to see where the counter pick is because Hollow Bastion just looks so good for Carfla. Mm, it allowed him to kind of just get that closer space, able to get those. Uh, <clears throat> sorry, that boy. Those, those basically kind of going on that free yeah. combo game. You know? Yeah, he got those confirms going for him. Unlike in game one, but game three, it is a completely different st uh, s situation. It could be a Carflow win, it could be a BDB win. Maybe they draw somehow, I don't know. You gotta uh, tune in to see what's gonna happen here. Don't go anywhere, I know you were thinking about leaving. Listen, the only thing I wanna draw is the conclusion of the set. Who's gonna come out on top? Yep. Is it BDB or is it Carflow? Take your picks in the chat right yep. now. Who's your hero? Everybody who gets, the, gets it wrong gets banned. Just kidding, but <laughs> wouldn't, that be fun? wouldn't that be funny? <laughs> I don't know. We'll see who's laughing. I know Jay Grum being in the chat looking and just like, all right, who can I ban? Who can I ban off a of straight comment? <laughs> Whose day can I ruin? You can ban me. The Wobble Man SR. Ban me. Off the comms. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, it's starting off even again. A lot like Game 2 did, but Game 2 uh, quickly went to Carflow's favor. So, uh, Ooh, there's a jab back air setting up, but amazing tech chase there from Carflow, but just quite not enough to get the KO. But, but finishes his food. He left a little bit on the plate and was like, wait, I gotta finish that. <laughs> Finishing those waffles indeed. I love that back air. It was so good. And now BDB definitely has to just take the stock, take that momentum. Oh my god, terrible. This is your opportunity the right worst now. No all punish. time, but it works. Oh. <laughs> Not the best punish you could do. Down so dash tech. Definitely yeah. could have opted for more, but hold up, we got another situation to kind of just take the stock away from car flow. Yeah. Oh, biking on up, but not able to steal it. 177, Roy with Rage, I'm terrified. That is crazy, yeah. And um, Wario definitely can get into a little bit of a, a struggle to kill, you know, uh, situation a lot of the times. We've seen it from a lot of the top Warriors too, where they just like constantly rinse and repeat until they can get that final uh, stray hit. There. Yeah, when they get out of those percentages, it becomes so, so rough, but I can see that Wario He's charging up that Super Saiyan energy to get it on out. Yep, and leads are so important versus Wario. Oh, because all aboard. Because the waft is always on deck, you almost, like, being in a lead is almost like being an even because of the waft, you know? You never know how it's going to impact your uh, your game. So you need to, you can't get complacent with the lead. You gotta keep keep pushing, keep, keep uh, getting the good punishes, keep getting the stocks. Yep, and I like how, this is what I love about BDB's play. I love whenever he goes high with the Wario and the bike to kind of mix up his opponent who can't really just jump that high and is already committed to kind of just edge guarding and just going for that low. And now look, he's in front position to kind of just take this game in. Carflow's just not able to make it back. And he struck the fear into Carflow right there. Because he because Carflow knew the back air was coming out, there was, on, there was only one thing he could do about it, which was an early up B, and uh, it wasn't good for him. <laughs> It was Definitely not good indeed. Good but hold up, this is free for Roy. Free stocks here. Back here off the bike. Just got Esgar out. But hold up, back here. Still in that stock as well. We're back to a nice and even game. It's what I would say if Warroy wasn't just glowing with the energy no, of a Saiyan right now. Yeah, he's definitely got that that uh, that Super Saiyan boost right now. For sure. Give him some yellow hair, you know? Listen, you see, whenever glo Brad goes yellow, that is the will of the people. If yeah. you've ever seen Zeta Gundam, how Kamiyu gets the will from the Zeta Gundam, this is what's happening. Bro, He's it, channeling the will of his people. And you have to, as Carflow, you have to not be thinking about the WAF at all times. Because as soon as you start thinking about the WAF, your play starts to get worse. And uh, BDB takes advantage of that. Just continue to play your game. This is just a normal Wario. He's, he's a scrub, okay? Think about him as a, he's a scrub. He's just 
It's Wario. He's, he's fat, you know. Yeah, and you can see Brad just slowing it down right now. Carflo needs that one down tilt. They're trying to find for that down smash, that S smash to kind of just read it on out, but Brad just oh, needs this one situation. solid lock. Edgar, hey. this is an alleged trap here for Beauty Bean. Oh my god. Fear Somehow. Factor City, baby. Oh. All right, forward throw is set up in the corner. Is it back air time? Oh, and the slap. Wow. And the waff of the taunt, too. All right, style the, on him. The layers of that edge guard were so insane. Because we saw in game two, BD Bean got a back air off the stage, killed Carflow at like 70 or 80%. Really early kill. Then we saw Carflow.